In this video, I'm going to specifically discuss the text split function limitation and how we can handle those limitation. So in first case, for example, if I want to split this text and I use a text split function here, I just specify the whole array. And in this case, my column delimiter is only the comma and I hit enter. It will return only me the first column detail mean a g m s t and it won't give me the all of the result now if we uh, even use the single cell reference for example i'm just going to reference a6 and hit enter it will give me the result but we need to drag this formula down and in the second case i want to split the text but this has comma as a column delimiter and pipe as a row delimiter if i use text split function in this case let's say text split function and I'm just specifying the text. So if I just assign the whole array again, my column delimiter in this case is the comma and my row delimiter in this case is the pipe symbol. And I just hit enter. It will only return me the first result. If I even just specify only the A19 reference, I'm just reviewing the range reference and just specify the single set reference. It will return me the result. But how i can drag this result down for example i want to drag this result and it won't working so how we can handle those two cases uh, uh, for example if you want the result like this one from this data set how we can handle those error i'm going to show you with two simple example first i will give you text join solution so if you write simply text join function and for the text join my delimiter so i will specify pipe is my delimiter ignore so yes they will be ignore the empty row so we will specify true and we just need to select all of the range hit enter and this will combine all of the data in single cell now we simply write text split function again and for the text split function this hall is my text which is a single column uh, sorry single row and column delimiter in this case is comma and my row delimiter in this case is the pipe symbol so i will just specify the pipe symbol and close the bracket hit enter and this will give me the result now if we just copy the same formula and i'm just going to paste it here and i specify the range from a16 to let's say a20 hit enter this will give me the result but this function has one limitation and if you have large data set this will give you an error and it will not split the data set the next solution i will give you using reduce function actually the reduce function loop row by row perform action save the result and then those result along with the next row result and then save the result and give us the end result so in this case i will specify my initial value as empty value and my array is the whole range i will type lambda and for the lambda parameter let me just define empty as e and range is r parameter and now we will write the vstack function i think you know about what is the vstack function vstack is actually combined the two array vertically so our first array is the null array so we will simply write uh, e and our second array in this case we want text split result so i will write text split function and for the text split function where is my text so i already defined text as a range and my column delimiter in this case is a comma and i will close the bracket and close the bracket for reduce hit enter and this will give me the result but what this na actually we define the first parameter in a single column so they are single column and there is no other thing that's why we can see an error of course we can simply uh, avoid this error using drop function so we will use drop function and for the drop function this whole is our array and how many column you want to drop from the top so we just want to specify one column we want to drop from the very top and we will close the bracket hit enter and this will give us the result now of course in this case we and also use the same function for the next scenario if we just uh, paste this function and from a6 to a10 i'm just going to write let's say a18 to a22 and i will close the bracket hit enter this will give me the result but what we need to do we just need to specify the row delimiter so in this case i'm just going to specify the row delimiter hit enter and this will give me all of the result i hope you like the solution please subscribe my channel for more video and if you have time please share this video as well thank you so much